Patients with myasthenia gravis experience a decreased ability of muscle movement. Let's see the neurological component of this disease and what we can do about it. The nervous system is a group of neurons with gaps in between. Electrical signals pass between these gaps from one neuron to the next with the help of neurotransmitters. This is the neurotransmitter acetylcholine. When acetylcholine binds to the receptor, it opens the receptor and allows sodium to enter. This is sodium. When sodium enters the neuron, its ionic charge allows the electrical signal to move from the last neuron to the next neuron. With acetylcholine bound to the receptor, the electrical signal fires until it reaches the muscle. This is acetylcholine esterase. This is an enzyme that breaks down acetylcholine. Breaking down acetylcholine will stop it from being able to open the receptor. If the receptor stays closed, then sodium cannot enter and the electrical signal cannot be relayed to the next nerve. Acetylcholine esterase inhibitors will bind to acetylcholine esterase and keep them from breaking down acetylcholine. Since acetylcholine is not broken down, it can bind to the receptor and allow sodium to enter. This allows the electrical signal to continue to the next neuron. With the nerve impulse continuing to its destination, the muscles can contract and relax.